Welcome to this explanatory video. In this guide, we'll walk you through the straightforward process of creating your own Minecraft server with Exaroton and installing the ViHub plugin to manage and monetize your server. Exaroton provides paid Minecraft servers, and the team behind it is the same as Eternos. If you're interested in trying a smaller server for free, you can check out our video linked in the top right corner. Let's start creating the server with Exaroton by heading to their website. Log in or sign up for an account. After logging in, you'll be on the main page where you can see the credits at the top middle of the page. These credits are used to pay for your server. To create your server, you can either start a new server or import data from Eternos, the free service to host Minecraft servers. Choose either Java or Bedrock Edition for your server and adjust its naming and description if needed. To install any mods or plugins, you need to choose a Minecraft server software. In this video, we will install Paper, but there are many other versions available. Choose the right version you want to install. Now that Paper is installed, you'll be able to see the Plugins tab in the menu on the left. There, you can find many mods and plugins to easily install on your server. As ViHub is not yet listed, head to the Files menu and in there, click on Plugins. You'll need to upload the ViHub plugin into this folder. To do so, sign up for a ViHub instance on our website. If you need help signing up for a ViHub account and instance, check out the video in the top right corner. Once you are in your ViHub instance, head to the settings. In the server settings, create a server bundle and a server. The address of the server can be found in the Exaroton dashboard. In this case, it is vihub.exaroton.me. Insert this in the settings for your server. The standard Minecraft port is 25565. Choose the Minecraft server bundle you created before and click Submit. Now, click on Setup and download the latest version of Vihub. In this case, we need the bucket-compatible version. Head back to the Exaroton Files menu. Open the Plugins folder and upload the ViHub plugin you downloaded just before. Now it's time to start your server. This may take a few minutes. Once the server shows it's online, you can view your server's statistics. Open the console where you will see that the ViHub plugin has been installed. To successfully connect, you need to run the setup command in the console. You can find the key back in the ViHub setup menu where you downloaded the latest version of ViHub. In there, generate and copy the command to paste it into the Exaroton console. Run the command. That's it. Your server is now connected to ViHub, and you can use all features our service provides. To access your server, open Minecraft and click on Multiplayer. Choose Add Server and define a name for your server. Enter the server address displayed on the Exaroton main dashboard. You are now able to join your server. Within ViHub, the server is now displayed as online. You can now log in to ViHub using your Minecraft account. To do so, you need to run the displayed command on the Minecraft server. As you can see, the login was successful. The dashboard now shows one active player on your server. 
and you can see your profile statistics. Congratulations! You have successfully set up and connected your server to ViHub. Discover all the possibilities that ViHub offers you. If you haven't yet, don't forget to join our Discord channel linked in the video description and subscribe to this channel to learn more about game servers and communities. See you in the next video.